In this video, we look at the workflow of keying media with an embedded alpha in the sequence. This is quite a common task. For example, you have been asked to key a title over a background. The supplied file sequence has been prepped with an embedded alpha channel for the transparency. Let's quickly recap the import process that you saw in an earlier video. Starting off in the Media Hub, navigate to the Embedded Alpha folder. Select the TIFF sequence clip. Looking at the General Import options, you can choose how to handle the Embedded Alpha channel. Include Alpha clip means that Smoke will create separate clips for the Fill and Alpha. Ignore Alpha channel means that Smoke will only create one clip for the Fill. So Create Matte Container creates a single container clip that contains the Fill and Alpha. This is how you represent a clip with an embedded transparency channel within the Smoke environment. When you choose to create a matte container clip, you get one more option in the Import settings. If you want the matte container to instantly key in the sequence, ensure that Add Compound Container is enabled. The Comp Timeline effects is what makes vertical layer compositing possible in the sequence. If you choose to have this option off, then you'll need to manually turn Comp on in the sequence. We'll see this working in a minute. With the Import settings determined, drag the TIFF sequence into the library. The new matte container clip looks like any other source clip in the library. Now switch to the Timeline view. In the Open sequence, I'll navigate to a specific shot using the UP and DOWN arrow keyboard shortcuts. Now ensure that SNAP is on and RIPPLE is off. Now go back to the library and drag the matte container clip to the sequence. Snap the front end of the clip to the positioner over the edit. If you already have a second video track, then just drop the clip above the edit. If you haven't got a second video track, hover the clip above the existing video track and the indications will tell you that it will create a new track in the sequence. When you release the clip, a new track is created and the video is edited into the sequence. Instantly, it is keyed over the background. You can scrub through the result and even play it back to preview it. Now remember what I said earlier about the Comp Timeline effects. If you had not enabled Add Comp on Container prior to importing this graphic, the Comp Timeline effects would be off in the effects pipeline. If I scrub the segment again, it will not key over the background. You would have to manually turn the Comp Timeline effects on and then it will key in the sequence as expected. You can now select the matte container and press RENDER to process the final result. So this is one workflow to deal with files with embedded alpha channels. Please move on to the next video to continue your Smoke Getting Started experience.